Google Wave is one of the most exciting new tools around. It combines some of the best features from blogs, wikis, instant messenger, and forums all in one interface. So in Wave, a group of people can simultaneously edit the same thing at the same time. So you can actually watch your coworkers' cursors as they type on your screen. It's pretty cool stuff, but you know, what will you actually use it for? Most likely, your organization's documentation lives on a shared network drive somewhere where people open those documents and edit them and email them around and I am about them and multiple copies proliferate. And there's no way to see what's the most recent copy of the document. Google Wave tries to solve these problems. First, Wave is a killer app for taking meeting notes. If you're in a conference room with 12 people and one speaker, everybody taking their own individual notes, it's a lot more efficient if everyone's taking notes into the same document. And it creates this kind of efficient back channel. You don't have to interrupt the presenter to ask a question. You can ask it in Wave and another attendee can answer. Latecomers can catch up on what they missed just by playing back the Wave. Another great use of Wave is remote collaboration with someone who's not in the office with you. You know those group emails that go around with like 20 questions and bullet points and everybody responds to one thing or another and it's just a million copies and everybody's inbox at the same time? Wave solves that problem. If you create one Wave with a list of points, people can go in and chat in the Wave and reply to those points in line in one place. Finally, Google Wave can serve as a light company intranet where documentation can live and grow over time. Say you're planning a company picnic. Before the event, you can add a poll asking who can make it, a list of items that people can bring where, they, where participants can jump in and say, hey, I'll bring that, hey, I'll bring this. You can add a map to the park where the picnic is located. After the event, people can upload pictures and co-collaborate on captions from the event. Whether or not Google Wave gets widely adopted remains to be seen. But whether it's Wave or another Web 2.0 application, this kind of real-time collaboration in a living workspace will replace those dead documents on your shared drives eventually.